Hi guys, today I wanted to share with you some quite interesting behavior uh, about read file. And before moving further, can you answer what will happen actually with uh, these three blocks of code? So let's see what is happening here. First of all, we are reading a file. Uh, if there is an error that will output it, otherwise we'd like to return, I mean, we'd like to show first three characters of this file. And it works exactly the same for the rest of them. I mean, for the file of 100 megabytes and for the file of one gigabyte size. So let's see how it works. Uh, I've run this file with uh, Node.js. And here we go. Here you can see that it works for the file with the 1 megabyte and 100 megabytes. However, it doesn't work for the file of the size 1 gigabyte and it returns that Node.js cannot create a string longer than these characters. And that is actually a really big problem for me since uh, I thought that uh, this code is quite reliable and I won't have any problems with it. So what should we do actually to avoid this uh, behavior and how we can deal with it? To answer this question, I want to share with you the second file. And here you can see that I use create read stream instead of read file. It is quite obvious, uh, we create a stream and subscribe to this event and just read first three characters and then destroy the stream. It works exactly the same for the second file that we, we had just had an error. So let's see node solution.js and here we go. Here you can see that absolutely not a big deal we can get uh, the value from this file and what is even more interesting about it i wanted to pay your attention to is that uh, talking about 100 megabit file you can see that we start our time and we end our time here and it took uh, 100 milliseconds but what about uh, gig one gigabyte file and read stream here you can see that it took just 5 milliseconds. So in other words, if you are looking for a way how to read some part of data from the file, then definitely reading this information with the stream can be way more performant. And I think that it should be the way that you need to choose if all you need is just to read uh, a part of your file and not the whole one. And that was actually it, uh, what I wanted to share with you today. So the source code is available by the link, which is in the description. And see you next time.